Hi, this is Nisim. Uh, this video is another video about the Video Cosmos uh, model. Uh, since the last video, I understood that you cannot use the 14B, it's 14 billion parameters uh, model. You have to use the 7B, which is the 7 billion. It, this is crucial because the 14B can take you five, six hours, three hours to render. Unlike the 7B that will take you only 15 minutes, I have the 4090 GPU and this is crazy change. I want to show you some of the videos I created with the, this model. Now, you can see that the video is very smooth. Why? You can see that everything video is standing still and the video just give it from a different angle. Here you see the image is not so uh, stable, but if the elements are steady, you're getting a very good video. Okay, here you still see some shaky, the table is moving, etc. But most of them are very steady and it looks good. Okay, here the water, because it's water, so it looks okay, but you, you can see the stone are really shaky okay also here this is look good it's steady now i will show you a video that is not uh, steady let's say cats i created cats and it not lo looks uh, so good i just ask for cats that running and uh, jumping okay now i might can do 10 20 videos of cats and i will find one or two that are okay but for moving element, let's say that woman, it not look good. But the, all the rest of it, it look good. Okay? You can see that the building is okay, but the moving part are not so good. Also that one. That one done with the model of the 14 billion. Okay? I expected it, to, it, it took it like four hours, and I expected it to be okay, but no. Now you can see that the around area is okay, but not the, el the element that move, this woman moving back, okay, which is crazy. If, it, if this, the element is steady and it's moving like in this, in this spaceship, it's okay. It looks fine compared, okay, or that one. When the element is not, doesn't have moving part like a human being, an animal, it's okay. So it's a steady element that just move a little bit and the rest is also a steady. So it's, it will look okay. Okay. You can see this as well. This is look good, really good because they are not moving. Now the, the water is, is okay, but it's not alive. It's like everything that is supposed to be alive is not moving well. Like those fish, you can see that it's not look good appear, disappear, jumping. Now I want to show the workflow, which is very simple. So I have here the OpenAI module that I created. You have it in the GitHub in the description. You, you can use it. You just get, need to give it the API key and you can just uh, it generate from these uh, three uh, words. I get this beautiful description and I don't need to copy paste from the OpenAI all the time. And the second, the second part is the, is the uh, model itself. So again, you, you can see that, that I have here multiple models. Do not use the 14B, only the 7, it's important. I will show you the description from where to download it. Second, you have uh, the clip. The clip is the one that actually taking the text and convert it to the embedding that the, that the model will understand and use. So you have this one. Now you can see that we have old, you can see here, we have T, uh, old T5. Now, we have the alt 5 Let me move it a little higher. You have the alt 5 16 and 8. You need to use the 8. If you use the 14, the 7B model, you must use the um, FP8, which is a floating point 8. It's uh, less memory, half of the memory. And do not use the normal one. Do not use those. Those will not match to that specifically with, to that specific model, and you get errors all the time. Okay. 
the last thing is the VAE that you also can download it from, from the description. You, you will see all, all the links there. Now, you will have a very specific um, latent space that, that was created for that model. In this case, I added another image so you can do the start image and the end image. And as, as you can see here, it's actually doing some nice effect. Not, not uh, uh, perfect, but it's very nice. Now you see here the, in the latent, you have the, uh, the frame, the length. This is the, the amount of frame. This is five seconds, 24 by five is 120. Now, you, the, one of the issues here is that how this model work. You see here the steps. The model actually taking all the images, all the frames, and do the first step on all of them. And then the second one, third one, etc., etc., etc. Okay, this is this is important because if you will give it lots of frames, it will stuck, and it can take lo a very long time to uh, do it. Right now, the amount of time, as you can see in this uh, in this uh, output of my uh, config log, you can see that an image, a video, took around fifteen minutes, fifteen to sixteen minutes for each one which is a reasonable time, okay? I have a car, the 4090, and, I, and uh, I need also like another 15 gigabyte of memory for this model, okay? And all of them took me around 15 to 16 minutes, which is okay. On 3060 or 3070, it can take you like four or five times, okay? So this is the latent. And as, as usual, it's connected to the case sampler and get the normal parameter, just make sure that there is multi-steps. Okay, which is important. The output is going directly to, to video because I don't want to get a PNG or stuff like that. I want it as an MP4. I'm giving it quality 19, which is okay. You can give 10, you get 10 times file, but I don't need it. Uh, and you get here the frame rate and etc. And in the end, you will get the nice video. Now I want to show you where, when you download everything, Okay, so you, you need to put them in the, in the right folders. So in my model folder, uh, you have the unit, which you, which you set all the, 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 the model itself. The clip, okay, will hold the old T5, okay, where you also have the T5 for other uh, model, other video models or other models. And the VAE will also will fit here. Okay, uh, so this is the location of the file in your config. Usually, if you use, uh, if you if you don't have an external folder for the for all the call, for all the models, you will have this model folder inside the config UI folder. So go there, and it's the, the same mechanism. Okay, now all the models will be in in those URLs. You see here we have all the models. Stay away of the 30 gigabyte uh, models. They are not working well on most of the of the GPUs. It takes years to run it. It's like it's crazy amount of memory, cra and crazy amount of rendering. This is the old uh, T5 that you will need to uh, download. Uh, you, it's enough to download that one, the floating point eight, and you have only one for the VAE. So down, download those. Now, as I said, this model is amazing for steady elements, okay? It's very good for, for that, like a camera shooting, moving around, etc. okay? It's very good for, for that. All, and also, as you, as you saw, you still have issues. But for moving part, I don't see it, uh, I don't see the use case for now, unless you will invest long time in uh, make it uh, and in try and error until you will get w what you want in a good quality because it's a five seconds uh, videos okay that's it thank you very much and subscribe like and help me to spread the word bye